Okay, well, congratulations, uh, Marina. When did you first hear about this? I heard a few weeks ago, um, and then I've had to wait till yesterday, and then I didn't hear any more, so I thought, oh, maybe, it, maybe it's not happening, but I got a phone call yesterday to say it had gone up to the press, I thought. Fantastic. Yeah. Now, you're sworn to secrecy, aren't you? Yes, you're did not you... allowed to tell anyone. Did you tell Kenny? Yes, yeah. <laughs> And I told the kids. And did I told you? my mother, yeah. Ah, yeah. right. And did the children, they kept it quiet? They, yeah. Fantastic. Yeah. So, when did you actually go and get it, do you know? Don't know yet, no. 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 Anyway, I mean, I know uh, you've been interviewed all afternoon and you were telling the other journalists that uh, really it's not just for you, it's for all the people that work for your charity. And can you just say a little bit about that? Well, the charity's got my name on it, so... So they've sent the award to me, but really it's for everyone who's supported the charity right. and helped with the charity. So it's really more for the Marina Douglas appeal than for me. Fantastic. So, and yeah. thank you to everyone that's helped. Right. Kenny, you must be extremely proud. Yeah, yeah. Really. Um, Marina's worked really hard um, yeah. to make the charity the success that it has been. Yeah. Um, the events that we take on board and uh, the monies that have been received have all going 100% to where it should go. Yeah. Um, there's no, there's not been any overheads. Um, Wonderful. The, the interest from the money that's in the bank helps to pay the costs of uh, uh, one person's wage. And it's fantastic recognition, but at the very outset, Marina did it because we wanted to show her appreciation for the fantastic care that, that she got while she was in the hospital mm. five years ago. Mm. And uh, it's just snowballed from there. But the real heroes are the people who have uh, supported the events and put their hands in their pockets. And that, they've made it the success that it has been. And the people on Merseyside have got a facility at uh, the hospital that they can be very, very proud of. And, and uh, if they have to use it, then it's very comfortable surrounds. But as I say, they've done fantastically well. That's why the charity has been the success that it has been. Fantastic. Now, it does continue, doesn't it, Marina, because you've got a new appeal, is that right? Yes, we've got a new appeal. It's Buy a Brick Appeal, and for £5, if you log on to our website or Liverpool Football Club's website, you can buy a brick which goes towards the £5 million that we're trying to raise for the radiotherapy centre at University Hospital Aintree. Super. Can you tell me what the, the name of the site is so we can... It's mariadaglishappeal.org, and it's Liverpool Football Club. Website. LFC TV. LFC TV. Com. Com. That's great. Well, congratulations for all, from all the readers at the Post and Echo. Uh, that's wonderful. Thanks. Thank Where are you going to keep them all? Uh, the, are they are they interchangeable? Isn't hers? Yeah. Or well, did they we'll come with a pink we'll ribbon? Yeah, but I have a pink ribbon and a blue ribbon. <laughs> that's in, oh no, you can't do that. Oh, no, no. <laughs> Should we do the housework with a hat on? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much, Andy. That's super. Thank you. Thank you.